Good morning, guys. Happy Monday. Today, I want to inspire all of you uh, women and, and girls and men and boys to be yourself. Just be yourself and be who you're meant to be. And if you encounter somebody who doesn't understand you, that's okay. Just keep on being you because in the end, God has a plan for you and for your life. And when you try to be somebody that you're not, you're cheating yourself. Girls are up, it is five to nine and they literally just got up. They're just starting homeschool. I love the days they get up, run downstairs and run to their computers. However, in three seconds, you already have a whole play thing set up. <coughs> That's a nice jump though. That's like a baby Azzy and such a cool jump. Guys, do you bet that the pony can jump this high? Okay guys, do you bet that this tiny pony, look at, he can almost walk under that jump. Do you bet that he could jump that high? Okay. Vote now, right? Yes. Okay. okay, let's see, see if he can do it. Whoa, that was an over jump if I saw one. <laughs> Yay, he can do it. All right, now it's time to get back to work. I have a lot of things on the agenda today. We got homeschool, we have to learn about government. The year is almost over and we, we still haven't done our government um, unit and it's because who likes studying government? <laughs> Not this girl, but I'm gonna do it because these girls need to learn all about our government, right? Yeah, it's gonna happen. So that's gonna happen today. We have uh, three days left, three days until we're back at the trailer, but our internet is getting hooked up on Wednesday. I just keep saying that, so their videos should not be late all week. I am so excited for how amazing this summer is gonna be with the horses. Yesterday I had the best day at the barn, the best day. It was just so relaxed. The less people there, the more relaxing it is. Anyway, I'm excited. Let's get this day started. My first uh oh, what happened? He cuddled into you? Yeah, yeah, he's a sweet boy. And Macy is the boss of Ruby. Ruby wants to play, and Macy's like, back off, girl. <laughs> Macy, but just wait, because my I'm having throat problems now. <laughs> it's hard being a chihuahua, isn't it? Ruby, she's saying no. She doesn't want to play. Best friends. This is a life lesson, you guys. This is a lesson in life. If you can't make friends with the with the other dogs that live in your house, or the other kids that are at your school, make friends with somebody else. Ruby and Dustpan are best friends. They spend all their time together. Ruby has never connected with our little dogs in a way that she has with our cat, and that's okay. Our cat likes to play with our dog, and that's all Ruby wants. She just wants somebody to play with her. Doesn't matter what she looks like, doesn't matter what breed she is. All that matters is that she's a good friend. And sometimes they have arguments, and that's okay too. But a good friend will teach you things, they'll teach you patience, they'll teach you how to be kind, how to be gentle if you're not so gentle. I'm wondering if it's the size thing. Our dogs are a quarter of the size of our cat, so maybe Ruby prefers friends that are her size. Clearly, our chihuahuas are all about the food because Sophie's got her breakfast there and she's surrounded by chihuahuas. <laughs> Cat over food. Yeah, she even chooses the cat over food. And she's patient. She's like, I'll just wait here while you rest and then we'll play. Friends can be different ages. Friends can have different skin colors. Friends can be boys and girls. They can have different interests or they can have same interests. Well, I think they connect because they're both playful. Today was such a good day. I got all the laundry done. I got all the grass cut, most of the grass cut. And now we're at the barn. Sometimes when we get here, the storm's already up at the barn and it's like winning the lottery. So you don't have to go walk. Until Sophia's like, oh, I want to ride and I have to go down anyway to get Sabrina. But Sabrina gets sad when storm leaves without her. All right, pay attention because there's gonna be a quiz sometime. If you guys aren't always following us on Instagram, 
then you should be because that's where we always have all of our fun. So you guys know our instructor sources are all the same color, right? And I can never tell which one is which. Can you guys tell them apart? I wanna know. Anyway, Kaylee's mom taught me how to tell them apart. So, Hope over there has no white socks on her feet. Wiser, on the other hand, looks like he's been dipped in paint and all of his four white socks are the same height, pretty much. And the other one is Journey. Yep, it's Gabby's lesson, but Sophie's going for it. I'm bored to death on the job. I'm sick of walking this dog. It's like I live in a fog. Tonight I want something new. I feel the need to get rude. I'm tired of watching the tube. Sophie's doing no stirrups. Squeeze! Quiet hands, squeeze! 
Yeah. If your horse has mane. Yeah. Two, one. Good job. Get her on. Keep going. That's it. A little more canter. Boom, boom, boom. Let's go. Two, three, four. It's hard. Put your whip in your other hand for me. Switch your whip. Put your whip in your other hand. There you go. Good. And a little bit more pace and he'll get his lead. Stretch up in your light seat. Heels down. Booty up. There. Tap, tap. You want him to reach for those jumps. The slower he goes, the harder it is for him to get those changes. Go. 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 Get her. Get her. Get her. More can. Good boy. If you just look where you want to go, you don't need to pull on him. Tap, tap with your whip. Tap. Tap, tap. Tap, tap. Stretch up, pull. Grab pull that strap. Kiss, kiss. Two, one. One more jump. Go fast, gallop the jump. Stretch up, come on. Good boy. Give him a fast. So, you need to think about when you jump, not leaning on him quite so much. Because he puts his head down so much, when you lean on him, he goes into the corner and you fall forward and he goes, Ugh. right? So you want to think when you land, those thighs need to be holding that out. Okay? Hold those thighs on real tight. <laughs> Come on, Gabby. Come on, jump the jump. Why not? That's not an excuse. Tell her why, what your fear is. What is that? What is the issue? Because I don't want you. Her fear, no, that's not acceptable. Her fear is that she can do it in a sitting okay. canter, but not in a light. So when we're in a sitting canter, it's harder on our horse to go over the jump. So by learning to do it in the light seat canter, we're already in the two point, okay? You don't have to change anything. You just have to hold that strap and let him do his job. So in the light seat, you just stretch down your heel and stand there. Nothing changes. He'll do his job. You just hold that strap and let him go. You can do this. And if you lean back a little bit, just don't sit your bum cheeks down. You'll be fine. Oh, Jesse. <laughs> Abby, it's two holes lower than what you jumped in your lesson last week. Two holes. <coughs> Are you going to be a dressage rider from now on? No, do it the right way. Come on. Hurry up. If they were really big jumps, I could understand, but it's actually smaller than the crossroads you were jumping there. <clears throat> we all have faith in you. All of us. Trot over it, pick up your camera, and let's do it again. You hear them calling, shouting your name. Turn up the collar. All of these verticals, I purposely made smaller than the like crossroads. Feels like you're falling. Grab your strap, stretch up to the sky. Two, one. Stretch up. One. Fix your lead, honey, and do it again. This time we're trying to get a little straight into the middle of that crossroads. 
trail. Apparently he wants to do that one too. One, two, and three, jump. One, two, three, and four. Excellent. Keep your tear. You're going across the diagonal, red and white. He really wants to do that one. <laughs> Diagonal red and white, look up. One, two, three, and four. Good, keep on eight. You're gonna draw this other line. Draw it in. Good, looking up, down the line. Eyes ahead, squeeze. Eyes ahead, squeeze. Gabby. You're done. Now you two jump. Go. Bring it down. Circle. This is your last circle and then we're jumping it. I noticed. I'll hear your motive. You're good. 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 You got it. You got it. You got it. Two, three, four. Good job. Give him a pass. Very nicely done, Gabby. He's doing really good. So even though, you know what I see about Storm? Even though you have your nerves, he's still going over it for you. A lot of horses will say, okay, my mom is scared, so I'm not jumping this because something must be scary. There's got to be trolls underneath it or something. And he's saying, I got you, Gabby. I can do this. He says, it's okay if you're nervous because I can do it. That's a really good benefit to having a horse. Give him a big pat, cool nose. You can jump. Gotta wear it. Make sure you do grab onto her mane though, so you don't grab her mouth over the jump, okay, honey? about fear. 
A lot of you guys probably don't know, but Gabby is still afraid of jumping. She still has some fear, and pretty much it's about cantering a jump in light seats. She is afraid to do that. She's terrified. So if you want to put the jumps really low and she tried to get her through it. And with Gabby, she the kind of personality that she is is that you have to make her. You just have to say you're doing it and that's it. And she'll fight to the death, but then she does it one time and she's like, oh, oh okay. Anyway, so she did it today, whereas last week she didn't do it. And hopefully that's enough to get her over the edge. But the fear is real, you guys. I get little girls all the time telling me, and because it's real, it's hard. Did you see me do uh, no stirrups? We saw you do no, no stirrups and we saw you jumping. go with Storm and Storm's down there and Sabrina's supposed to be going this way and <laughs> she's going where she wants come on get her going this way Got it. Good pull her, pull her, pull her. Help, help pull her. There you go. That's you yeah, she's a little bit hurt bound. She likes to be with Storm. So she decided she was gonna go with Storm and she really almost got there. I'm bringing the rake with me in case she poops along the way. But now that I have the rake with me, she's not gonna poop along the way. That's just the way it always works for me. Today was a really hard lesson for Gabby. She has a really hard time getting past her fear and I'm the same way. And she's the kind of kid though that will never go past your fear unless something happens to force her to do it. Whereas Sophie is a lot like me and she'll be like, that's it, I'm tired of this. I'm not gonna be afraid anymore and then she'll just do it. Sophie pushes herself and Gabby not as much. Okay, Spur Patrol. You guys noticed it's been two days now and you guys haven't said anything about Gabby's lack of spurs. Not that they were spurs, they were motivators. Totally different thing. But you guys didn't say anything, you guys haven't noticed. That was our goal was to slowly transition him so that he would just go without needing them and he's doing super well. Pony Squad. When are we gonna get our shirts? We need to find a place that makes them. So if you guys can see, somebody got the okay, she can ride again. And someone got the zebra pony. And somebody got the zebra pony, the slow poke. Sabrina, Sabrina's always got to be in the front. That's the kind of horse she is. No, she's excited to go home. And Storm's always got to be in the back. That's what kind of pony he is. Yes. Bye, Sabrina. Bye-bye. The pony club has left me, you guys. Whenever they get together, they just want to play so much. But I don't mind because just being at the... Just being in the field with the horses by myself and the quiet, it's like it's so good for your soul. Anyway, it's late, we are headed home. And I have a video coming out on our channel soon about why we love our barn. The girls and I shot it today, it was super exciting. And I wanna know what you guys wanna see on Gabby's channel. We're kinda of running out of ideas. And Sophie's video coming out soon, I just gotta get time to edit it. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.